What's up YouTube, Tricky Traveler? So I have some exciting news, some good news, and then as you can tell from the title of the video, some slight bad news. Shin is getting a direct nerf and an indirect nerf in the upcoming patches. Yes, it's still on PB, so it's not official yet, but it looks like it will be official. Kind of a bummer. But anyway, getting into the exciting news, I am back home. I was out of town for a few days, and I missed an upload. I apologize. I brought my videos with me on a hard drive to edit and upload while I was away. However, my laptop, um, which isn't all that great, and my internet, where I was, was not all that great. And it's just, I tried to upload it four or five times, would not upload. So I apologize for missing a video upload yesterday, but I will make it up to you, I promise. Um, that being said, I am going to be back to live streaming my Unranked to Diamond series, playing only Shin, uh, tomorrow, Thursday at 6 p.m. EST, and also again on Friday, same time, 6 p.m. EST. But yeah, we're doing our Unranked to Diamond series right now, playing only Shin, where we're uploading every single game to the channel to help you guys learn. This is not a pub stomp where we just beat up on lower elo kids. This is a series to help you guys learn and to show you what I do literally every single game to help you guys learn and climb your way to diamond. So win or lose, feed or feastin', we're uploading every single game to the YouTube channel to help you guys learn. Um, whether you play Shin or not, it's still a really good series to help you learn the game. So that is all good stuff. We are back to that. The second exciting news, let me hold up. I got a full, full webcam, don't I? Oh my goodness, look at this go. Shin Din merch, baby. So I kind of dropped a ball on this one. You can only buy it for the next six hours. I probably should have posted this video yesterday or the day before to give you guys a little bit of he heads up. You have six hours to buy the remainder of the Shinden First Edition merch. And yes, everything on the site says First Edition. I'll put the link to the uh, website down below to buy the merch. And I think it's also in the, the merch shelf as well. But yeah, there's t-shirts, there's women's v-necks, there's hoodies, there's mugs, there's laptop stickers, there's all kinds of good Shinden first edition stuff. But if you want the OG Shinden stuff that will only be available for the next six hours, because I kind of dropped the ball, um, yeah, now's the time to buy it. Like, literally, now's the time to buy it, because six hours later, you ain't buying it. So, <laughs> um, yeah, so that is that. I will be releasing new merch. We did hit our merch goal um, that we set, so I'll be releasing new stuff in a couple months. Better designs, better quality stuff, and I'm super, super stoked for it. Um, that being said, let's get into the nerfs on Shen. So let me switch back over to here so y'all can see what I'm doing. Um, getting into the direct nerf, it is Shen's Q, Twilight Assault. Spare Blade Collision, slow change from 35% at all ranks to scaling to 35%. So it's a very minor nerf. It's one of those nerfs you look at and you're like, why? Because it doesn't really make sense. First of all, no one's complaining about Shen's Q being too strong. No, that's that's not a thing. Who has ever said that? Second of all, why would you just change it to scaling? I mean, that's such a slight nerf. Also, if you run approach velocity every game like I do, this doesn't even matter because you get the movement speed boost regardless of what the percentage slow is. So I don't understand this. Like, <laughs> Shin's already a garbage champion in solo queue. He's barely played in pro play. I don't understand why they keep nerfing him. This is like the third or fourth nerf in a row. They extended his cooldown as ultimate. They took away damage from his Q. Um, they've got this now. I, I don't understand what Riot Games is doing with Shin. They are just trying to ruin him. And I don't understand. All in all, this is a very minor nerf. It's not a big deal. Especially since I run Approach Velocity. But if you don't, I guess you'll kind of notice it. But yeah, this is, this is just one of those things that Riot is just clearly showing how unintelligent they are. Like, this is just not a smart thing to do. Like, I, <laughs> there's no data to support this nerf, is what I'm trying to say. I don't understand this. Uh, anyway, getting into the indirect nerf, which is one that actually matters. This is the nerf that actually is going to hurt Shen a lot. Um, they are increasing... I should probably look at this one first. This is the first one. Increasing the cooldown of teleport from 300 to 360. So they're adding a minute cooldown to teleport. Obviously, you guys know Shin loves teleport, so this is a kind of a bigger nerf. If you run Cosmic Insight, which I don't anymore, um, you can get, I think, like 18 seconds back or whatever. Don't quote me on that. You can get a few seconds back with the 5% cooldown. However, still annoying. I don't, I don't know, man. I, I don't really like what Riot is doing with the whole top lane situation or with League in general, but it's whatever. Uh, yeah, this is what they're doing. They're increasing teleport by 360 seconds. Also, they are getting rid of the reduced cooldown when it's canceled. So if you cancel it now, it goes back on full cooldown, which is kind of a bummer. Before, if you canceled it, you got a reduced cooldown. 
That is no longer true. Now you go back to your full cooldown, which is a bummer. Um, but yeah, so those are the two nerfs. The direct nerf to Shin, I don't really care about. It's whatever, because I run approach velocity. It doesn't really affect me all that much. Um, this one, however, does affect me. Now, with this coming into play, will we start seeing Exhaust and Ignite Shin top lane? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I still think Teleport's going to be the best, but you know, I may just have to try it out. I may have to try it out. But anyway, that is all I have for you guys today. Hopefully that was informative. I hope I hope that was informative. Yeah, but those are the two nerfs for Shin. If you want your Shinden merch, you have six hours to buy it. Probably five by the time you watch this video. I'm sorry. I was out of town. I should have uploaded this video earlier, but regardless. I think, you know what I could do? I just, I just thought of this like just now. I probably could log in and see if I could extend the sale. Uh, comment down below if you want me to extend the sale, if you plan on buying merch and won't be able to do it in the next six hours. Because uh, I kind of didn't give anyone a heads up that the sale was ending um, outside of like a week ago or five days ago or whatever. So uh, yeah, so I may do that. If you, if you want to buy merch and you're not going to be able to buy it today, but you will later on, let me know in the comments below and I will extend it if enough people say, hey, I want to buy it, but I can't do it today. Um, if not, then I'll just go ahead and end it. Um, but yeah, regardless, we hit our merch goal. So thank you guys so much. You guys are incredible, incredible. So tomorrow we'll be back to live streaming our Unranked to Diamond series on this account. Uh, we are currently 4-0, so we're off to a good start. Hopefully, hopefully we can get placed gold or higher, but I don't know. We'll see. Last time we did it, we got placed silver too. Um, it took us 111 games to get the diamond, so... I'm hoping to do it in less than 100. That is the plan. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Please remember to like this video. I'd really appreciate it. Subscribe if you guys have not. And uh, have a lovely rest of your ninja flipping day.